Let me tell you a story. I was once told this story it was the greatest love story ever written in America. And I lived through it. So I was driving down the road one day in my 18 wheeler. I saw a man that I ain't never seen before in these parts, so I picked him up. He climbed inside my cab and I asked him, Hey fella, where you headed? It don't matter to me. So what do you mean? You ain't got no family? He said, nah man. Just me oh my. And I said, that's good news. So I'm just me oh my as well. I said, hey buddy, I, uh, I gotta stop at this here gas station, my, my rig's getting low, you know what I mean? I said, go ahead, friend, got some stuff I'd like to pick up from the stove, if you know what I mean. So I uh, purchased my fuel and made my way on over to the shooters, because I uh, felt the lager egg come on. I was in that shirt, I couldn't help but notice some little quarter things you put in and the little surprise comes out for you. They had condoms, glow-in-the-dark condoms, little pictures of women, little gay men. I thought hell for shits and gigs, closed my eyes, flipped my coin, heads I went for the gay men, tails condoms. So I flipped that coin. Good old lucky double sided heads coin. So I sat down that cell to take my ship with my little gay book. When I heard my stranger friend come on in, he sat down that stall right next to me. I heard him pushing one out so ferocious. That thing splashed, it sounded like the Loch Ness had jumped. I said, God damn, friend. You eat pretty good for a homeless man. I said, yeah, I swallow a lot of cum. I worked up just enough nerve to ask him if he would swallow my cum. This is about how it went. Hey, buddy, don't think I'm no fairy or nothing like that, but I got cum too. And I'd be obliged to share it with you. He crept on over to the stall. I already had my drawers down. He got down on them patched up pants, the holes in the knees, and I knew what he had been doing. So I flopped my big old hairy ass cock out with veins running down the side of it like lightning bolts in a thunderstorm. My balls is the saggiest two fucking bowling balls in a paper sack. Ooh, that homeless man grabbed me with his dirty hands on my shaft and began stroking my head. So goddamn fierce I couldn't believe it. It's better than any man I've ever been with. Don't stop.